Hey, welcome to Eat More Carbs. My name's Brett from eatmorecarbs.com, this channel right here on YouTube, and of course, facebook.com slash what? Eat more carbs. Uh, my inspiration to one of the greatest people ever to exist is Freely the Banana Girl, and uh, you can find her on YouTube, and you can find her at 30bananasaday.com. And uh, so uh, I subscribe to her videos. Every day I get a notification. I go watch them. They're informative. They're inspirational. She's cute to look at. What can be wrong with watching Freely the Banana Girl? And so uh, today she was talking about this guy, this uh, this boogie guy who's just extremely obese. And um, she played some clips of one of his videos, and I really related to it because uh, a little over a year ago, that's where I was coming from. And I can relate to the pain, and I can relate to feeling like you're losing your life because the loss of mobility is coming around the corner, and um, you know things that normally were simple get more challenging every day, and you feel hopeless. So I understood, I understood all the stuff he was saying, and then I see, uh, you know, where he's tried this keto thing. I tried the keto thing. I even researched it and found some bogus, I mean, there's a lot of bogus crap on the internet. And I actually thought it was healthy. It's not healthy. It's just not healthy. Anyways, eating a, a raw or mostly raw vegan lifestyle is the way to go. Definitely vegan. Um, if you just read all the things that come along with animal products, it's all the cancer, all the heart disease, all the internal organ disease, all the skin diseases, all that stuff comes from animal products. It's been proven endlessly. Uh, anyways, I'm not. This, that's not what this video is about. So Freely's getting beat up about trying to help this guy. She's just trying to help him. She wasn't being mean. Uh, she was being accused of uh, fat shaming him. And I really love this new phrase you see online anymore. Skinny shaming, fat shaming, blah 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 shaming. It's so it's so stupid and infantile. She wasn't doing any of that. I've been fat shamed a billion times in my life. Trust me, being fat since I was like six, I know a little bit about it. That's not what she was doing. She's trying to help the guy. So I thought I would devote my video today to trying to help her help him. So uh, she has way more followers than me, but she didn't specifically ask her followers to do this, but. You know, if you watch these videos, um, you can see the name of her video and find it on YouTube. And uh, we'll show you a picture of it again. There's, a, there's a, uh, what it looks like on the screen there. And um, go find his channel. And here's his channel. It's easy to find. You can just search his username. And on one or more of his videos or on his basic video channel, just comment and go, Look, dude, give this a try for seven days just seven days it only took me a couple of days and i knew that my life would change forever and uh, i don't have problems with mobility now i still have a lot of weight left to lose i've lost uh well i think i've lost 80 pounds now 79 some i don't know I'll lose count 79 something like that and so uh i don't have those issues anymore i'm progressing more and more to where i want to be and the health that I feel is just phenomenal. And I want this guy to experience that. I feel for him. So I went and commented on all those videos. I offered my help. I also went and linked to her video. She's way more qualified to help him than I am. I'm more qualified than her to know where he's coming from. Because, you know, she has a past that she came from. And it wasn't rosy. She was never to the extent overweight that me or this guy is. So I, I can relate to him. But just let me tell you. <laughs> This guy needs help. He, if he wants to salvage his life, he needs help. And he doesn't need to be cramming his body full of fat and cholesterol. It's not good. You can look at the pseudoscience on it and they make it look real good. But if you look at the genuine science on it, there's too many doctors that have proven that you can reverse cancer. You can turn cancer cells off. You can reverse heart disease. And the subjects they had to test this on were the worst of the worst. That's the only ones you can get to agree to the test. These are the ones that conventional medicine gave up on. Dr. Esselstyn, that reversed heart disease, he only had the very worst heart patients to, to put on the, the uh, you know, the raw, vegan, no animal food lifestyle. And he, and he reversed heart disease in almost all of them. The only ones that died uh, from that were the ones that stopped being compliant on it, went back to eating animal foods. I mean, the proof is overwhelming. Anyway, look, I want this video to be short. Go help this guy. Post a link to this video on his page. Post a link to her video on his page. You go, look, 
here's people that can help you, man. You've tried it the other way. You've tried keto. You felt like you were starving. Why did you fall off of that diet? Why? Because your body was still starving. I don't care if you were eating 10,000 calories a day. You were starving. Your body runs off glucose. That's what your cells run off of. That's what they need. That's what they crave. That's not what makes you fat. Freely, the banana girl explains that way better than I ever could. Go watch her videos. Dude, if by some chance, Boogie, you've made it to this video, and maybe Freely's appeal didn't work for you, look, hugely overweight guy to overweight guy. Just try it. Feed your body. You will be so amazed the cravings will go away. When you give your body what it needs and what it craves, the, the nutrition that it needs, it stops craving crap. And then the whole rest of the process gets really easy. I wish you the best, Boogie. I love you freely, the banana girl. And remember, eat more carbs. For real, eat them. Eat them up. Eat them.